Hello everyone! Today I am going to do an unboxing of Once Upon a Book Club box. Uh, this is, I believe, the May box. Um, but the reason why I wanted to do this box is because uh, I was able to read a arc of this book and actually uh, help Once Upon a Book Club uh, put this box together. So that was kind of fun. Um, I also did it with um, the last love song. Um, you can see that unboxing. So let's see. <clears throat> I'm pretty excited. I usually try to get spoilers because I like spoilers, but I have not gotten anything. So there's that. Oh, I kind of like how they put everything in a little uh, pouch. So let's actually look at what's in the pouch first. There is a bookmark, a signed book plate, which is nice, and uh, their author letter, and a uh, little thing to talk about the book. So I'll put that down for just a second. And then, this is the book, it is called, ah, everything right here is falling, put it here. So, this is uh, A Betting Woman, a novel of Madame a Mustache. Now, this is a story, uh, real sto uh, based on a true story of a lady who used to have, um, a uh, kind of gambling halls in the in, in the old west days uh, and uh, just uh, how she came to be like that. I actually was surprised that I really enjoyed this book. Um, there's two romances that are kind of interwoven but and I usually don't like like love triangles and more than one person romance. But this one, it was, I like the way they did it, because when she was in love with one person, she was in love with him, and then when she was in love with the other guy, she was in love with him, um, and it didn't really cross, which I liked. And the historical period, I had to go on and try to find uh, out about her. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find the pages and then open the gifts. So if you guys want some spoilers, here you go. So the first one is on page 75, and it's says, there's little stickies where to open the gifts, um, he finessed one more spot, then turned the canvas around. I laughed, even while my forehead creased, and I fought the urge to run from embarrassment. Uh, you've removed all my underclothes? So this is one of the guys that she likes, and he paints her. And because he's a painter, and I kind of like how it's like in the old time newspaper. I'll use my scissors for this. And this was an, an important uh, gift because the picture actually. Uh, plays a part throughout uh, the whole uh, uh, book. So uh, you can see she kind of has a dress on, uh, but it's very light. I mean, just kind of like a sketch. So there's that one. Um, I think. All right. And then the next page is, I think, oh, actually, I was wrong. There is uh, page 39, so I'll have to go back. Uh, he smiled, um, showed a blackened tooth. Play with you? I wished for gloves as I palmed the deck. 
Do you see anyone else sitting here, Monsieur? Uh, brandishing a set of a, a deck of cards. So since she's a uh, has a gambling hall, what better way to have a better thing to have in a gambling hall than a deck of cards? So a black deck of cards. Very nice. And the next one is, I think, on 218. Or 197, sorry. That's the other gift. In that moment, I felt as no one could. I rolled the dice. It was clear my mountain men enjoyed the chuckaluck. But it, this, it was my invention that they loved and that they asked for. Huh, I wonder what that is. So she um, she basically plays a lot of like roulette and 21 with them. And uh, she also does kind of like the, I wonder if this is a roulette. I forget which one is what she calls roulette. I want to be very careful with this. does look like a little <laughs> little game that you get. Let's see if there's a little peg. Ah! And roll this out. And people put their bets on which one they want. I think there, there's instructions on the other side. Well, that's kind of interesting. Um, I'm wondering if there was... Oh, the little, um, the little coins I think were supposed to be in here. All right. So, that's actually kind of an interesting game. I like games. So, yeah, the coin, the little thing, kind of a... A mini roulette thing. Maybe you, you can start your own uh, gambling hall with the stuff they're giving you. <laughs> and then the last one is 218. Bonjour. I did not break my stride. However, I twisted my parasol to my other side to keep an eye on him. Huh. Are we going to get a parasol? Um, maybe. And it is a uh, an umbrella. I kind of want to see how it So, there's that. <laughs> uh, I actually don't have, any, don't have any car umbrella, so I might use it for that. So, we shall see. So those are the gifts in uh, A Betting Woman, and uh, if you like historical books, uh, you will like this one. It's kind of like historical romance with gambling and the Old West and all that uh, thrown in. So I hope you uh, enjoyed this unboxing. What was your favorite uh, gift? If you got this box, will you be playing cards and uh, chuckle luck? Uh, so let me know. 
Uh, anyway, hope you like this uh, quick unboxing. Uh, like and subscribe, and I'll talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.